equations for graphic display calculator. 2. Equations with real roots. Hi everyone! In this video, we are going to show how to solve equations with real roots using Casio FX CZ50. Switch on your calculator pressing AC button. Press the menu button to open the main menu, then move the cursor, or press A to select the equation function. We are going to look at the equation x cubed minus x squared plus 2x equals 0. There are three possible ways to work this out with this calculator. The first method is using the equation function. Press F2 to select polynomial equation. The question is cubic, so press F2. The equation needs to be entered in the form of f of x equals 0. Make sure to use bracket minus, not subtraction minus, to input negative numbers. Enter the coefficient 1 minus 1 minus 2 and 0. Press F1 to solve the equation. The answers are 2, 0 and minus 1. Next, we are to solve the same equation graphically. Press the menu button to open the main menu, then select the graph function. Check that the graph function shows y equals, then enter the cubic function y equals x cubed minus x squared minus 2x. x need to be entered using the x theta t key. To get the power of 3, we will need to press the hat key. Press X6 to draw the graph. The graph is drawn. To find where the function value is 0, we need to find the x-intercept, also known as the root. Press Shift to access the command menu. Press F5 to display G-solve. Then press F1, root. The first interception of the x coordinate is minus 1. Press the right side of the cursor to find other solutions. The other solutions are 0 and 2, which are the same as the answers found in the previous part. Since we are dealing with real root, it is possible to find the solutions using the solver function of this calculator as well. Let me explain how to use this function next. With CZ50, two solver functions are installed. Solver function we are able to find under the equation in the main menu is useful if an equation includes multiple variables and we substitute values in such variables to find out an unknown. The other solver function is called solveN. Solve n is suitable when we want to find multiple solutions of an equation at the same time. Our equation is x cubed minus x squared minus 2x, and because we want to find the root, we should use solve n here. Let's use the solve n function. Go back to the main menu and open one, one matrix function, and press execute. Press Option. Press F4 and display the calc menu. Press F5 to select Solve N. Enter information in Solve N. We need to make sure we enter the information in the following order. Solve N, bracket, 
equation, comma, variable you want to find, bracket close. In this example, our entry to solve n will look like solve n bracket x cubed minus x squared minus 2x equals 0, comma, x bracket close. Once everything has entered, press Execute. We will get a warning saying there are several solutions to this equation. We press Exit to continue. The solutions are displayed and they are minus 1, 0 and 2. These are the same as our solutions we found earlier part of this video. In this video, we have shown how to solve equations with real roots. Graphic Display Calculator, as easy as pie.